Hey guys, what's up? Minecraft and more back with another video. And today, what I want to show you guys is another awesome command creation by IG Minecraft. So today, the command that we are going to be reviewing is called the More Armor command. This command just came out, and I hope you guys will enjoy this. So let's get into this command right now. So I'm first going to show you how to get a command block and how to install this command. It is very easy. It requires nothing but an internet browser. And, um simple command so let's do this so first you're going to go slash give okay at a command underscore block and then it'll give you a command block so you do that and it'll give you a command block and then you take this command block you put it over here okay or wherever you want and then um you can just right click it and then you're going to take the command from the link in the description below i will leave it there and what you're going to want to do, this is very important, you're, if you're on a Mac, you want to go on Google Chrome. The Safari does not work, so any other internet browser other than Safari, I think, works. So you can't use Safari, which kind of sucks, but yeah. So you're going to have to go Control-V, and there you go. The command is here from any other thing from Safari. I use Google Chrome. It's great. Um, so then it should appear on the screen like that. And then what you're going to do is you're going to want to activate this command block with some sort of piece of redstone. I kind of do a different one every time. Let's go. You know what? Let's go with a lever today. I feel I feel like a lever. So you can right click it. There you go. Stand back just a bit. And there you go. There's the command. It appears in a big box and it says 1.10 more armor by IG Minecraft. And if we read the terms of use, I already know it, so I have to credit him. So yeah, I'm gonna leave his website in the description below for him. Um and yeah, let's do this. So it says more armor command by Arja Minecraft, and now we have to right click to sign to get items. So what we get is oak wood planks, oak wood, and an armor stand. And there's also a destroy sign to destroy the machine once you're done with it. You could also deactivate the machine, which just stops all the things that makes it work. So what we're gonna do over here is we're gonna go over here. We're gonna put oak wood planks right here. We're gonna put oak wood on top. You could actually do anything. You could put oak wood on top on the bottom, and then you're gonna put an armor stand, and that will create a shop with three people inside of it. You have a Bobby over there. There is Ricky, and there is the mysterious priest. So there's three people in this, and I'm gonna show you what these people sell. So I'm just gonna get some items first. So I'll just go into my inventory, get some items. Um, yeah. So we're gonna need some Nether stars. Get 64 of those, and we're also gonna need some diamond blocks. So let's get another stack of those to get our stuff. So, now that we have this, we can go to the first person that sells things. His name is Bobby. So, oh yeah, I have auto jump on. I love this feature in 1.10. So, we're going to go to Bobby, and he sells three boots, I think. Or is it two boots? No, he sells three boots. The f it goes more expensive each time you look at them. So, let's go. So, you're going to need some nether stars and some diamond blocks to buy each one. It's very expensive, of course, because these are really cool boots. So, you're going to buy the three boots. And there we go. So... We're going to put this back in our inventory. We don't really need it right now. And we're just going to put this in our inventory like this. So we have three boots. The first one is called the double jump boots, the flying boots, and then we have the teleport boots. So let's review the first one. Let's put them, let's put them on. I think we're going to go to survival for this. Yeah, it makes more sense. Oops, I, I can't type. There we go. Okay, there we go. Survival mode. And I'm probably going to need some food or, you know, let's put it on peaceful for now. All right, so the first boots are the double jump boots. And what these boots do when you put them on, let's put them on right now. And they're not that good for armor since they're only chain boots, but still, they're pretty awesome effects. So what you can do is you can jump and then you can jump again. So I just want to show you guys this in third person. You jump and then you can jump again. So this is really useful. You can jump really high. You can jump once, and then jump all the way on top of this. So you can jump a lot of blocks. You can jump probably onto trees and really awesome things like low trees like this, like a birch tree. Yeah, there we go. So we can jump onto trees. It's really awesome for this feature. So you can jump really high, and you also don't take fall damage with these boots, which is great. So if you fall from really high, you do not take any damage. So, let's, I guess we'll review the second pair of boots, and so you pretty much you get an infinite jump boost 3, which is cool. So now let's the flying boots. So these flying boots, um, it's kind of self-explanatory. If you hold shift, you can fly. And you can't go, the only bad part about this is you can't go forwards or backwards. You have to just go straight up in a line. 
and then you can kind of go a bit forward. So that's the only thing. It's good to get away from enemies or other people in survival mode, but you can't actually fly that much. You can just go straight up in the sky, and you also don't take fall damage with these boots as well. And now there's a third boots, which are probably my personal favorite, which are the teleport boots. These ones are the most expensive, and they are the best. If you hold shift and look in any direction, you can go super fast in that direction. Look how fast you go. Like, you can go pretty fast. It's way faster than flying, so those flying boots you wouldn't even need. So you teleport into the direction, and it's really awesome. You're, like, super fast. It's almost like an Enderman, you know? Where the heck did I just go? Oh, okay. There we go. So, yeah, it's super fast, and it's really useful. So I guess we're going to go to the uh, to, to creative mode now. Oopsies, I have caps lock on. Let's go back to creative, and I just want to get some steak, because this part we're going to need to go back onto normal mode. Because, yeah. So, let's take off these boots, I guess. And we're going to use them for later. So, now, what we're going to do is we're going to go to Ricky, and he sells chest plates. So, Bobby sells um, boots, and Ricky sells chest plates. So, let's go to the chest plate section. And these are actually going to need gold blocks and nether stars, I'm pretty sure. All of them, yeah. So, it's a bit, it's actually a bit cheaper, technically. I don't know if gold blocks are cheaper, but... Depends on what you have in your survival game. So we're going to need some gold blocks for this. And here we go. So we're going to put this and this inside. And then we can get the wither chest plate. The light power chest plate. And the heavenly chest plate. So all three of those, they're really awesome. So you definitely want them. So these three chest plates, we're going to go into survival mode. We're just going to get some things first. I just need some of these. No, I don't need zombies. What am I saying? I need some witches. Those are some good mobs, you know. So there we go. So we got we got some witches, and we're gonna try on the first three chest plates. We're just gonna go to survival. There we go. So now that we are here, we're gonna go out of peaceful. We're gonna go to easy mode, and let's just try this these chest plates out. So the wither chest plate. Let's try that on first. So put that on. So it doesn't have any special effect while you're wearing it, but if you go into, if you spawn, like, multiple, if there's multiple mobs around you, you can just hold shift and they'll all start getting withered. So you'll get, you'll get the effects of the potions and whatever. You have to move out of the way a bit, but they're gonna die pretty fast. So they should be almost dead. And how far away can you do this? You can't do them very far away. I'm probably going to die, so I should probably run. But you see how it works, so... They are fighting each other now, so... That sucks. But, yeah, so it damages them really fast. If, you had a, if I had armor on, actual armor... Let's run again. How are they not dead? I don't understand that. So it's supposed to do a lot of damage. It's giving them the wither effect, but witches have a lot of health. Damn it, you stupid witch. But yeah, if I had a diamond sword right now, I could finish them off, so... There we go. Let's just get a diamond sword, I guess, just to finish them off. To finish each of them off, they're probably all one-hit kills now. Well, the problem with witches is that they do... They heal themselves, which kind of sucks. That's the only problem with witches. They're drinking potions of healing right now. There we go. So, yeah, with witches they heal themselves, but they would be dead long by then if they if they didn't couldn't heal themselves, which kind of sucks. So now we're gonna go on to the light power chest plate, I think. Yeah. So light power chest plate, it only works over ground. So pretty much it generates a lot of power. So I'll show you. So if you're so it generates power, 
and um, using light. So pretty much you have a lot of power, and when you spawn in mobs, so let's just go to let's go to survival. I am about to die, so maybe I should uh, hold on, hold off for a second. Okay, so let's just regen, I guess. Okay, we should be good for now because I have lots of power. So now when we hit something like a witch, it does a lot more damage. Like, watch, if I hold shift, you see all that fire above me? Look how much damage I'll do. Look how much damage I just did. I just did so much damage. So if you hold shift, and let's say I spawn something in, it's, it's probably almost a one-hit kill. Witch, come back here. See how much damage that did? It's a two-hit kill. It's so fast and easy for them. Oh, come on. I have poison again. So it gives you strength um, if, you're, if like, you're not holding shift. But if you're holding shift, you're, you get strength four. So that's how great it is. So it's really useful, and it kills a lot of things really fast. And now let's go to the third chest plate. This chest plate is very interesting. So this chest plate is called no, not the wither chest plate. I want the heavenly chest plate. So pretty much um everywhere you look, um heavenly orbs will spawn. So if I look around, oh, there's one right there. So you can click on I don't know what you do you just jump? Oh yeah, you can collect it like that. And then you can, when you get a bunch of these orbs, like, they'll spawn, and only people with that chest plate can actually see those orbs. So that's what's really useful. And you can get some awesome train, trades with the Mysterious Priest. So if you look over here, the orbs will spawn everywhere. But let's go to the Mysterious Priest. You can get, with two divine orbs, you can get a stack of bread, which is crazy. Um, with four, you can get a stack of wood, stack of redstone for six, stack of emeralds for eight, and then 10 bottles of enchanting, a whole stack, and that's a creative-only item. So that'd be really useful. So let's say I got two now, because I, well, I got two, I just got two. One. And they spawn every now and then, and it's really easy to get them. So I can just get a stack of bread for, like, doing nothing, except for making that chest plate. So that's how useful it is. So, yeah. So these are all the armor and trades you can get in this command. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you're, at, if you're new to my channel, then don't forget to subscribe. Because I have videos every single day. Um, yeah, so you're going to get videos daily. Um, I do lots of awesome stuff. Minecraft, Minecraft Hawk Edition, Clash Royale, Pokemon Go now. And, yeah, lots of awesome stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys later. And once again, this is Minecraft and more. Signing off.